Bonjour and welcome to my January newsletter from Marseille. I hope you enjoy the views of the city as I update you on what I've been up to for this past month. I'm still alive, I'm still healthy, and now I'm actually living in the center of town and I'm involved with ministry in my church, uh, which is directed towards university students and I'm so excited to be involved with them, which you'll be able to see a little bit. I'm now living in the center of town, but my church is on the most outer district of the city, so it takes a lot of public transportation and traveling. And there's actually a house type situation at the church that I go to where three other people live and they gave me a room there so that I can stay during the week because I usually work very late into the night with uh, many people. Uh, and so for this reason, I basically live in two different places half of the time in the city and at my church. Um, so it's quite exciting and it's something that I never expected, which ministers also is something that I never expected to do as I am reaching just many international university students and I get to work with them practice French a lot and teach a lot of English as well and I've been just experiencing so many different things. Um, there have been a lot of strikes and manifestations and protests recently uh, that happened right outside of our apartment and it's pretty crazy because they just seem like parades which uh, you can see at the end of this video but um, I've also been experiencing a lot of the culture of Marseille through food uh, which I have never really tried before, uh, such as Indian, Vietnamese, and Thai food, Chinese food, and obviously French food, which I've tried so many different types of cheeses and breads and uh, meat like duck and foie gras and even snails. Um, and I also get to interact uh, with so many different people from my church and from the university near my church. During New Year's Eve, me and people on my team who I celebrated New Year's Eve with, we went to my church and when the uh, countdown was over, we got probably over 50 different bisous from 50 different people um, all at once. So it was quite the cultural experience um, and it's so fun uh, just learning small things and, and becoming so accustomed to the culture like that. Uh, so that's all uh, about all I've got for you for this month, but please reach out if you'd like to hear about anything that I am up to in more detail. I will also provide prayer requests in this email as I would absolutely love intercession for language learning and ministry as I'm still continuing on with my classes full time. Uh, so merci and au revoir. Gâteau, sauce, sauce, sauce. Wow. Ah, ok, ça, 